Hey guys. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I'm gonna be doing a review. I'm gonna be doing a review on the Bella Beauty Skin Solutions Cleansing Facial Brunch. Everyone online says that this is one of the dupes for the Clarisonic, and the Clarisonic ranges from like $100 and up, and I don't know how much it really costs, but it's just too expensive, and I just don't wanna to commit to spending that money, but let's get in with the review. Obviously, I've been using it, so like this brush right here is Zerche Girl. This is the one I've been using. It's a sensitive brush, and this one right here is the normal brush if you have normal skin, but I have really sensitive skin, so I just try to stick to things that say sensitive skin. I'll break out like this, and homegirl don't want that. Homegirl don't want that. So this is a waterproof one, and you can bring it in the shower, and it's battery operated, and all you have to do is press that little button. I don't know if you can hear it. And you can change the speed. This says it improves overall skin and health and appearance. Perfect for all skin types. Reduces oily skin and helps unclog pores. And then it just talks about how it's waterproof and whatever. Apparently it's good for everyday use, but this is where the shade comes in. I looked on YouTube when I was buying this. This is only like $15. I got it at like Marshalls or something. And I was like, should I spend $15? Is this even gonna be worth my $15? I asked myself. And the answer is no. I got this about a month ago because I really wanted to try it out before I even said anything about it. Like I wanted to just be like, oh my God, I'm in love with it. But I had to try it out first. And honestly, girl, this is not Pedro approved. Don't spend your money. I don't even care if it's $15. This brush right here is a sensitive skin brush, and I'm not kidding when I tell you this. It is like scratching your face. <laughs> like, don't spend the money on this. I don't care what anybody says. People on YouTube are saying that this is a good. It is not good. I don't, if you have like rough ass skin that can take anything, I guess go for it. There's a normal brush and I don't even use a normal brush. My boyfriend used a normal brush cause he wanted to try it too. And he said that it's like scratchy, like it scratches your skin. And it's not even like I'm not putting enough of my cleanser on it to make it soapy or anything. It just honestly, it sucks. This is not an everyday thing. First of all, you shouldn't even want to exfoliate your face every single day because that's not good for you. But this is just, it's just a bad product. Don't spend money on it. It's not even cute. Like, what is this? And look at this. The bristles, I don't know if you guys can tell. I want to bring it closer, but the sun is going to mess up my thing. <laughs> the bristles are horrid. Like, they're dirty as hell. I cleaned it one time when I had makeup on, and look what happened. It, like, stains, which... It's just leaving all of your freaking foundation and all that stuff to the bottom of the bristles, which is just holding all the bacteria. So it's like, that defeats the purpose. Just don't buy it. Um, it's not worth it. Ooh, it's actually not even $15. It's $12.99. It's horrible. Just don't buy it. Spend the extra bucks, save your money, and invest into a Clarisonic. That is something I'm going to do because... This is not worth it. There might be other dupes out there for the Clarisonic, but honestly, this is not worth it. Do not purchase it. Not approved. Hate it. Hashtag hate it. X marks bye. And another thing about this product. This right here, I can literally be using it and it can go like this. If you can't tell, it opened, which means water is getting inside where the battery is. So it's like, girl, don't call yourself waterproof. If y'all can't even hold the battery on your own. Don't listen to all these other people saying, Bella Beauty is so good, you need to purchase it. It's a dupe. It's not. It's really not. It feels like somebody's scratching on your face. It sucks. That is it for the video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. And for those of you who don't read my description, <laughs> I'm working on getting another camera. So I'm kind of trying to stay away from beauty videos for now because I'm almost close to buying my camera. I'm saving up to get my camera and the quality for this is just not showing the makeup. So I feel like what is the point of posting a bunch of makeup videos if you guys can't even see the true look of it. So that is coming soon, don't you worry. But anyways, I gotta go to work. So thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you next time.